stuff, knowing that's all the different stuff. What do you think when you saw that? Uh, like I said, I, I took it personally because I've never been a good at home by watching my toughness. And, uh, being one of the leaders of the team, I think that's a reflection of us. And, uh, and, uh, I, I laughed at it essentially now because at the end of the day, I think. Uh, well, he pretty much helped us you know, really realize how we need to play, how we need to play consistently. Was that part of that sense of urgency you talked about? Yeah, seeing that? Yeah, absolutely. What was uh, what's your uh, early impressions of Oklahoma State as a team? Well, they're a Big 12 team, typical, just get up and down a lot of possessions. Highly skilled at multiple positions, and just uh, they got a great coach that runs some great stuff to put those guys in a great position. How much does it mean for you not only to represent the University of Michigan? here in Indianapolis, but also the city of Detroit. Uh, I love my city. And, uh, uh, it means a lot to me. Uh, I take pride in being where I'm from. Showcasing how we play and how tough we are. It's, it means a lot to me. More importantly, it means a lot to me. What are the challenges that three-point-wise that this team presents? you got Jawan Evans and Forte and, and, and Jeff Carroll. A lot of guys, sort of like you guys, a lot of guys who can shoot the three. Um, the only thing about it, it spreads us out, but I think it, uh, you know, it makes us uh, a lot more hungry on that side of the ball, just knowing that uh, you know, they're really dangerous on that side of the ball. They just really want to lock in and turn those guys off the line and make sure we key it into our personal matchup in our scout report. Just, uh, you know, it just brings a different type of focus to this one. I understand you had Charles matched up against you and that he was mimicking Evans in, in practice yesterday. Yeah, Charles is... Uh, Different type of anime. He's tall and uh, he's long, but luckily, uh, Evans. Uh -huh. So, what about Charles? Do you think kind of pairs you best for this matchup? Uh, I think they're polar opposites, actually. Charles is really uh, he's six seven with long arms. You see what happens. Guarding him in practice is always tough because he's like, really athletic for it. But overall, they just don't really good players. Is it just the athleticism that's similar between the two of them? No, nah, no, nah, Charles is the leader. 100%. I think he had like a 44 and 30 or something crazy like that. And I think, it, like I said, he was just playing it because he's a really aggressive ball player. And yeah. He's, uh, he's able to make reads that a point guard can make. So I don't really think playing styles are the same. It just, you know, he's just you know, really capable of playing. Yeah, I guess Dockage also mimicked him today in practice. Oh, yeah, that made it 100 times easier. Uh, <laughs> it's easier to chase Dock around. <laughs> it's always fun, isn't it? The other guys are saying you think they like the fact that you guys are so close, so similar. Tell it all. Do you like that as well? Yeah, I think you. Uh it's easy for you to knock each other out rhythm, knowing that what you would like, knowing the looks that what you would want to get. Uh, it's easy to take those away because uh, pretty much if you say it like, like that, we're pretty much the same team when you look in the mirror. So uh, I think it makes it a lot easier when it's time to, uh, to play defense. What have you seen out of Zach? What changed the last uh, whatever, two weeks, three weeks? Nothing, actually. Um, I think he's just he's, uh, he's getting his shooting touch back. And that's all the difference. He's play, he plays great outside of scoring. and. He's a great facilitator. He's a, he's a great leader. I think I don't think anything's changed. He's able to hit the shots he's accustomed to making. Oklahoma State's got a really strong set of guards. How much are you looking forward to this challenge? Um, I look forward to each and every game. I won't say I don't value this one any more than other, but I teach every every, every game like it's my last, and you know, this will be no different. Did you value last week more than some others? Just from all that happened and all you guys were able to accomplish. Um, no, I think I, I just relish in the moment just as the rest of the other guys and just being able to do something special. Uh, you know, no guy would, no guy did more than any other guy to, to make that possible to me in my mind. And, uh, just knowing that and thinking like that, it just made the, the, the team victory that much sweeter. Is this team closer now than it was 10 days ago? Um, After all, it's been 